everybody and welcome to Adult Hands-On for January from the Rapid City Public Library. My name's Allie and today we're going to be making some delicious hot cocoa stirs. Let's get started and take a look at what we have in our craft kits today. In your take and make kit, you should have your instructions, three candy canes, I'm using just one for my demonstration today, some sprinkles, and your chocolate chips. Your first step is to place your chocolate chips into a microwave safe bowl or mug. I'm gonna use a bowl today. Next, you're going to microwave your chocolate chips on medium heat in one minute intervals until it's melted. So you wanna make sure to stir in between as well. So each minute, stir up your, uh, your chocolate chips until it's a nice smooth consistency. I'm going to melt my chocolate chips and I'll be right back. All right, so now I have my melted chocolate. It took about two minutes and a lot of stirring, but I've got this nice consistency now. And so I'm going to take my peppermint stick, and if you have a mug, it's a little bit easier. You can kind of just dip it in, but since I don't have a mug, I'm going to spoon the chocolate over my peppermint stick and just kind of evenly coat the bottom part of it. It doesn't have to be the prettiest, but you can kind of smooth it out a little bit, make it even. Let's fix this side a little bit. There we go. And now you wanna let this sit on some parchment paper, which I don't have, so I'm going to hold until it dries. And then you're going to take, or not until it dries, excuse me, until it hardens up just a little bit, but while it's still moist, you're gonna take your sprinkles and just sprinkle them on there. And now you have a beautiful hot cocoa stirrer. So you wanna let this set in your fridge for about 30 minutes before you use it. But once, you, once it's all set, you can use it to stir your hot cocoa, you can use it to stir your coffee, whichever you prefer, and it gives it a nice peppermint flavor on there. And that's how you make your hot cocoa stirs. All right, everyone, thanks for joining me as we made our hot cocoa stirs. You can use these to stir your hot cocoa or coffee, any sort of warm drink. You could even try it in tea, although I'm not sure how the chocolate would go with that. <laughs> Thanks for joining us today and make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel for more crafts and story times from the Rapid City Public Library and we hope to see you next time on Adult Hands On. Thanks so much guys. Bye!